with 11.7 to go. But the Wisconsin guard was just getting started. Jalen Reynolds defends for Xavier. Half looking on the inbounds. Gets it to Caning. Right side. Elevates for three. And the win. Bring it up. Yes. The actual Wayne Larravee, not our good friend Jacob, impersonating him. <laughs> On the Westwood One NCAA Tournament Radio Network, two threes in the final 12 seconds for a 66-63 Xavier win. Xavier lost in the East region in St. Louis, but that's yeah, somehow right. not the craziest <laughs> finish of the night. Texas A&M erasing a 12-point hole with 44 seconds left, beating Northern Iowa 92-88 in double OT. That's the largest last-minute lead lost in NCAA tournament history and all after Northern Iowa won its first game on a half-court buzzer beater. Two totally different feelings, for sure. You think Wes Washburn, <laughs> St. Joseph's, could not hold on to what a, a seven-point lead? Yeah, with... That was a question I was talking about yeah. before. What was it like to win in dramatic fashion, <laughs> then lose in dramatic fashion? St. Wow. Joe's was up seven with Barkley five. Barkley the whole time's going, see, I told you. <laughs> <laughs> the agony of winning on a buzzer beater. Well, with five and a half to Greg. go against top seeded Oregon, they lose 69 64. The Ducks on to a Thursday date with Duke. Earlier in the West Bracket, Oklahoma got by VCU 85 81. In the South, Maryland handled Hawaii 73 60, and Villanova ousted Iowa 87 68. And from the Midwest, Syracuse 75, Middle Tennessee 50. The Orange, the sixth ACC team.